start menu. Let me just show you around. This is the, okay, so this is the start menu. You can equip and unequip items. Uh, if you unequip your armor, your outfit, you'll be uh, almost naked, and people have different dialogues in town when you do that. Okay. But it's harder because you only have three hearts, and you'll get a special achievement uh, if you complete the game without wearing any armor. Oh, nice. Yeah, so this, these are the consumables uh, on this side. You can use them uh, on this menu or you can equip for a quick heal with the B bottom in combat. So in this town, uh, the mission is to go, you can go to the far east side of the town. There is an inn, go inside the inn and talk to the innkeeper. He'll send you to your first quest. Gotcha. So it's a Metroidvania uh, platformer in pixel art. Uh, it's an action RPE when you go to towns and talk to people and take quests, to go to dungeons. So it's like a full RPG in this side scroller view. Gotcha. This tower, you enter, you go up, and you'll see. Uh, go. Gotcha. And then uh, this is the place where the bird, that you will have a bird to fast travel the world map, and this is where he will leave you every time you come to this town. Gotcha. Yeah. So keep going to the east side, and you'll see a market. Yes. So in this market, uh, you'll be able to commerce in different stuff, and um, you will. Uh, th this last guy will give you a scroll, to, uh, so you'll gain a new ability. So you can roll with RB bottom. Yeah, you can accept. The So if you go to the start menu, and uh, here you have the scroll that you just acquired uh -huh. with the, full, the description. Just by acquiring this scroll, you'll have to collect them to gain new abilities. Gotcha. So you continue into the end from the other. So in this end, yeah. There will be a, there is a secret area right now that you cannot access if you go upstairs and then upstairs again. Uh, you can jump up the chandelier. You will not reach the second one yet, but there is a hidden door on the other side. If you try, there is a hidden door over there. Gotcha. That's later. Gotcha. So you talk to the bartender, that's the in innkeeper, the quest. This area uh, is the, the area you're supposed to get this quest and then do the Metroidvania inspiration until you discover these ruins. Uh -huh. For now, for this second this demo, you just tell our process here. Uh, and this is when the action platformer uh, part of the game starts. Gotcha. So the jumping and platforming are. Uh, a little bit hardcore precise uh, experience platform. There will be a, a curve, of, a learning curve, uh, and uh, some getting used to how it works. You have to jump on the very closer to the edges of, of every platform. Yes. You can, you can, uh, yeah, it's a, a full of traps. So you have to duck. The arrows coming for now. Okay. Yeah, this is my You want to heal now? Yeah, you want to heal because, yeah. <laughs> Every time you heal, it's uh, the H apple. Heals half a heart, so you okay. want to expand the healing. Because you still have one heart. Gotcha. There you go. So, for this plant, you can either crouch and kill it or roll past it. 
Gotcha. How do you roll again? With the R, B, bottom. Don't try it here because you'll fall. Yeah, it seems small, but you get rolls and uh, uh, yeah. So you're not like surprise, surprise. in the game or like yes, for, okay for this demo you will just continue from the same point but, okay uh, you'll have uh, enough uh, consumable items go to him right now just equip a new one on the other menu just to keep the watermelon okay yeah and use it actually from here so you don't die all right you're gonna you want to equip it so you go to the menu okay Attack in the air. Oh, okay. There you go. So here you got the uh, um, quest. The uh, quest item. This is the ring. And here you got the shield that you get to equip. Nice. You have to equip it. So you block with LB. Okay. And, and it will deflect. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So you block with LB and it will deflect uh, arrows. You will block the upcoming arrows. Gotcha. But not the um, close combat attacks. Gotcha. Uh, 
roll bus though. Uh, you know, I I'm using the, uh, the, the, the analog stick oh, to move. Oh, yeah, no, no, for now it's just the D-pad, but we'll have it on the D-pad and the analog as well. Gotcha. So you want to heal now with the potion because you were very low. Yeah, and then equip the cheese if you want, that you have many. You can equip the cheese. You said what now? Yeah, you can equip this one, the, go to the... To, to oh, okay. The and yeah, and remember about this plant, you have to go the other way. Alright. Oh, oh. <laughs> forgot about that plant. So the enemies always respond? They respond, yeah. Okay. So, oops. Back. Yeah. Well, that's good. It adds to the challenge of the game. Yes, yes, it's challenging. It's, uh, it's like a precise uh, platformer where you have to train your muscle memory. Yes. Oops. I know it looks more friendly than it actually is in the, right. in the gameplay. But this also because this is an advanced level, that you are just jumping right into the uh, more difficult action. This demo, uh, these uh, levels are uh, going to be an advanced levels in the game. Gotcha. So this is not the beginning at all. Gotcha. At this point, I'm going to. Uh, give you more items that we have on this demo but are not implemented so you don't uh, you don't get it them through the demo but here you can access them you have two new swords and one new armor okay and the, all the, the, the weapons have different uh, speeds and animations and, uh, and damage so this is the uh, the hardest part, actually, of this uh, demo. Oh, the you birds are coming at you, too. ravens, and you have to... Yes. Oh. You have to, yeah, you have to be patient and try to tackle them one at a time, because if not, they can get really uh, difficult. Gotcha. So, yeah, when you are uh, swinging the big sword and you are ducking, um, then the arrows go past you. Like if you attack and you when you attack and you're with the sword down, uh, you attack. Yeah, in that frame, uh -huh. uh, the arrows will pass uh, over you, so gotcha. you, you won't get hit. Gotcha. There is a plant here, so watch for that. Just uh, tackle these ravens once at a time. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. That is challenging, yeah. It is, it is. You have to, you have to kill them before continuing because if not, it gets pretty hasty. Oh. You have to take care of them before continuing. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, really? <laughs> so you can do is stay on this platform and kill the first one. Oh, okay. Oh, right. oh, damn. Yeah, yeah. Actually, let me heal first. Yes. When you jump on the second platform, don't worry about the archer, he's st static. Just worry about the second raven. Oh, okay. Oh, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there he comes. There you go. For the raven, oh, it's the plant. yeah, it's full of traps and enemies coming at you at the same time. So, yeah, you really, you really have to think of every, every movement in advance. And, uh, yeah, 
He continues, he's continuing shooting. So what you want to do is wait on the edge, more on the edge, just wait there, more on the edge, more, a little bit more, yeah. So when the arrow is just above your head, you can jump. Don't need to cross, yes, there you go. Nice. Mm. bird and becomes your friend and the, he leaves you back into the, the town now you have to give the ring to the to the innkeeper and uh, yeah he will just give you a new quest which it would be the last level for this demo gotcha. So yes, I started working on this game uh, three years ago. Actually, I had the idea to uh, start working on this game like five years ago. Uh, I've been doing the programming and the art by myself. Gotcha. Uh, yes, so... Oh, he gave you the second uh, quest. You have to go exit this um, inn and talk to the elder to the right side, outside of the inn. Gotcha. It's outside. Uh, go out. Out. some distance by rolling out of him. Uh, you cannot dock these projectiles, you have to block them or jump them or roll past them. Oh, yeah, you have to, yeah, you have to attack while in air so you can push it. expected release date for the game okay so uh, in April 17 so which is uh, like two weeks from now uh -huh. we'll start the Kickstarter campaign uh -huh. it gets funded the expected delivery will be for in a year and a half by next Christmas so uh, in 2019 gotcha. um, but backers will have a copy of this demo uh, and also uh, they will have uh, early access of the game so uh -huh. right after the yeah right after the uh, Kickstarter will work on the um, on the very on the first levels, uh -huh. and also so they can try trying the first part of the story and uh, levels, and um, so a few months after, just after the Kickstarter, they will have access to this part of the game. Gotcha. And they will get continually get updates until it gets final release on PC uh -huh. uh, um, next uh, by the end of next year. Great. 
So and um, it will have also um, porting to console as uh, stretch goals in the Kickstarter campaign. Uh -huh. If those if we reach those goals, we will have them. Uh, we will uh, use the. Uh, we'll, we were already are in contact with porting companies that will work on this game. Uh, during the development, so uh -huh. like three months after the game's release, it will be on console already. Nice, nice, yes. nice. Yes. Awesome. Well, Carlos, it was great talking to you. It's called, the game is called Feyland? Yes, Feyland, yeah. Okay. The website is tellgames.com or feylandgame.com. And uh, yeah, you can subscribe to the newsletter in the website to be updated with the kick, when the Kickstarter uh, goes live. Mm -hmm. and, uh, yeah, we really appreciate all the... Um, um, uh, support for the campaign and to continue uh, the journey on uh, finishing this game. That it has got a lot of good reception, so we are really excited about uh, releasing um, the first part, the first early access in a few months after the kick started. Great, great, great. Thanks, man. Appreciate thank, it. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, for coming over.